still tropical storm Faye failed to reach forecasters predictions of hurricane status, but Faye is flexing its muscles as a rainmaker. The storm moved out over the Atlantic Ocean late Wednesday after dumping heavy rains on the Sunshine State. Some areas reported up to five feet of standing water, leaving unlucky motorists stuck in partially submerged cars. I opened the window and I come out of the passenger side, feet first. Others aren't even bothering to try to drive, getting from place to place by boat instead. Mailboxes mark the edge of the road, even though it's completely submerged. For some lucky homeowners, the water is just far enough from the house to keep from seeping in. But road after road remain underwater, and other parts of the state may still face the same fate. Forecasters say Faye could double back and hit the northeastern part of Florida and Georgia. That would be a third blow for Florida from the same storm. Early Thursday, the storm was located about 20 miles east-southeast of Daytona Beach and headed in a northwesterly direction. Judy Boisha, The Associated Press.